Blues night is wrapping up in Green Square in Cedar Rapids. What a night to be outdoors listening to live music. But for some of the performers this evening, it was really a chance to rebound from the COVID-19 pandemic. KCRG tv Nine's Brian Tabak spoke to local blues artist Kevin Burt about getting his music career back on track. Live music is a way that songwriters can share their art with an audience. But for some artists, it's also a way to bounce back from the pandemic. Blues Night in the Park is a chance to get the family outside to enjoy some live music. Blues music. This is really what keeps people coming out. It's the way to enjoy this music. But for local artist Kevin Burt, Blues is a beautiful place to be. It's about getting his name back out there. And for the pandemic, silenced him. When COVID hit, it shut down my world. Burt won the International Blues Challenge in 2018 for his solo act. From there, his dreams started falling into place before it all came crashing down. 2019 happens, everything starts, everybody starts to find out who you are. 2020 happens and, and all the doors close. Getting a chance to play on stage in a place he calls home is all about getting back on track playing blues music in front of crowds and continuing what he started. It's coming, man. It's coming. You know, it's, it's not a dead sprint, but, you know, and that's the thing. Nothing that's nothing that's lasting happens quick. You know, you build it. And bringing people back together with his music. I love the passion of the performers and the way they really speak from their hearts. Two other bands that performed tonight also won the International Blues Challenge. The Keisha Pratt Band won Best Band in 2018, and Mateus Layton won that same award this year. In Cedar Rapids, Brian Tabbitt, KCRG TV9 News.